hi guys welcome back to my channel and thank you so much for clicking okay so in this video I'm gonna show you how to reset a forgotten password on your laptop so suppose you've forgotten your password and you don't want to lose any data kindly follow this video to the end so in many times people always forget their password and the only option that they see is to install a new operating system and you know it's very risky you might lose data or important application that you are using so basically with this video is very very important because I'm going to show you the safest way to reset the laptop's password without losing any data okay so guys also if you're new to this channel or you haven't subscribed to our channel please support our channel click on the subscribe button like our video and let us know what I'm thinking on the comment section alright guys thank you so much and let's begin to reset a password guys you know we're gonna use software the first software that we're gonna use is called Irens Boot CD so what you have to do is to go to your browser to download this software Irens Boot CD okay and another software that you are gonna use is Rufus so basically we are gonna make a flash disk bootable with Irens Boot CD okay so you have to have two softwares Irens Boot CD and Rufus okay so I have already downloaded these softwares so I'll go to my local disk to see and begin the process okay so let me just take you to the where I place the software so as you can see here is my errands boot CD version 15.2 and uh, my Rufus is always here here is my Rufus okay so let's begin the business So the first step guys is always to to plug in your USB drive or flash disk through which you want to boot uh, Irens boot and now you go to where Rufus is and uh, you click run Rufus to boot uh, the flash using Irens boot CD so that we can reset our forgotten password so you select Irens boot okay go to directories where it is and now guys you select Irens boot cd dot iso and then click open leave it leave everything the way they are and just click on start all right and make sure that the flash that we that you're gonna use here is a empty flash or you know make sure that you back up the data before you start this process because all the data in that flash disk will be destroyed okay all right so let's just wait for it to be finished so that we can begin the process of uh, resetting the password okay all right so i'll post this video till the copying is done and uh, the flash is ready so that we can use it okay all right okay so as you can see the process is already finished so what we're gonna do is to close and uh, eject the the flash drive and plug into the computer that we want to reset the password so that we I can show you the steps involved all right so let's get to another screen all right guys so this is the computer that we are going to reset the password we forgot the password as you can see there is a user by the name user and if you try to enter the last password that the user tried it's not going through so we are gonna use this computer to demonstrate to how we can reset password so what we need to do guys is to turn off this computer and we plug in the, S the SD card I mean the flash disk that we just booted using air and smooth so just shut it down make sure that you shut it down then plug in the flash disk or the USB drive and start booting okay all right so let's just give it time so that it can go off all right so it's off 
that's the first bit that we're gonna use so make sure that you plug it in to the USB port of the of the desktop all right this is the same process that you can do both to lap, laptop and a desktop computer because they are using the same system okay all right so what you need to do is to plug it in then turn on the computer and immediately start pressing the boot key remember i was this was the this was a hp desktop okay so you use f9 for hp laptop you use f9 for dell f12 okay so it's try to choose uh, the our usb drive which is a general u disk 5.0 and you hit enter right that one general u disk 5.0 and you hit enter so that we can boot from our flash drive okay okay so this is the interface it's a linux interface we're gonna use commands here to reset the passwords so scroll down to offline password changer and you hit enter okay all right so just hit enter and then just give it time to load the command that we're gonna use okay so, so scroll down scroll down until you reach here so i'm gonna show you something here so here we are going to select a number that corresponds to a volume that our operating system is installed in okay because that's where the passwords are stored right so as you can see we have number one two three and the last uh, volume is where the operating system is installed so we are going to select it down here so that we can proceed to resetting the password so make sure that you choose the right volume or partition because you might find there are several volumes listed there. So just know that, just know which volume is carrying the operating system and choose that volume and proceed to the next steps. Just let me, sh so let me show you. So as we have said that uh, number three is where our operating system is installed so we choose number three and now okay guys so after selecting volume three we get this information here after reading this you are being asked do you wish to force it just click yes and continue right okay so we just say you yes why okay and uh, you just hit enter 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 just hit enter until you receive a menu of uh, password reset just continue hitting enter just hit enter there okay so okay guys so as you can see we're being asked which which part of registry do you want to load so we want to reset the password of this computer so we just select option one okay for password reset so that we can proceed with the resetting the password using errands boot and hit enter and now we are being directed to another menu we have several options here as you can see one nine and q so we want to edit user data and passwords so just enter number one and continue so i've entered option one and just scroll down to see other more options okay guys so here we are being listed with all the users in this computer we have the administrator guests default account user and you know this account is using user as the user account okay we just write the user there and hit enter and now here as we can see clear password number one okay just choose number one clear user password of the user and now we're being asked password cleared successfully now quit just write enter exclamation mark there and hit enter again exclamation mark because exclamation will quit okay after clearing the password exclamation mark and now again quit q just write on q to quit again we don't want to edit user because we have reset the password so just quit all right guys here is very important just write yes because you want to write the changes okay all right so after writing the changes meaning you have successfully reset the password you will be asked to run the application again guys you know this is a kind of forcing something you have to run it over and over again at least two times so i've run it again i've pressed yes and i chose uh, drive to, uh -huh. i've chose volume three as before and now i just hit enter and now option one of password reset okay 
and now the user was user just write user okay the call that you want to reset the password just write user okay and hit enter okay and then clear password option one all right and now quit all right do you want to write yes okay now i don't want to run the application again just write no and now finally guys you have to press Control alt and delete at the same time then to restart the computer and finally remove the flash drive I have just pressed uh, Control hard delete and uh, immediately I removed the flash drive and now the computer has restarted So we want to see if the password has been removed successfully. So let's just give it time You know, it was a, it's a matter of forcing things So you have to repeat the process over and over again at least two times or three times you know yeah so let's just give you time to see if the password has been erased successfully erase boost is a very it's a perfect software for resetting passwords without data loss okay all right so let's check it's still uh, coming up all right as guys as you can see now we are not being asked password okay but when but before when we were trying to access the computer we were being asked password so as you can see it's going to welcome direct okay no password is as is required because we cleared password using Irens boot. We deleted all the password that was used to protect this account. So guys, basically Irens boot is a very very important uh, so tool to reset your password. It's a very simple tool to use. Just follow the video. Be keen on what parts to say yes and the, the option to choose so that you can be successful in password recovery. Recovery, I mean okay all right so i have even locked the computer again to see if it will ask password so let's just see okay let's just give you time so guys as you can see no password is required it's going to sign in direct without any password asking thank you guys please subscribe to my channel for more video bye and see you again in the next video bye thank you bye